Hey, what's going on guys? So I've got some great news for the upcoming Wolverine 3 movie, or as everybody else is calling it, Old Man Logan. So I'll be putting a link in the description below so you guys can check out the article. But according to multiple sources, Wolverine 3 will take place in the future, unlike the previous films which took place in the 1970s and 1980s. This is the reason why everybody's calling it all the Old Man Logan film. So for those of you who don't know, the Old Man Logan story takes place in a post-apocalyptic world where supervillains have taken control of the United States and killed off most of the major heroes. After a tragedy that involves his former X-Men team, Logan is living in seclusion and refusing to draw his claws ever again. This is until the hero stumbles into a mission he simply can't ignore. Now this is the perfect setup because, you know, this movie takes place in the future and Hugh Jackman said this is the last time he's ever going to be playing Wolverine. So all of this just pieces together for making this uh, the ultimate final film for Hugh Jackman as Wolverine. You know, I personally think that this will be an Old Man Logan film, but probably a slightly different version from the comics. Different because most of the characters that are in the actual story in the comic are owned by Disney. So it'll be a little bit difficult to pull this off. And they could do the same thing they did with Quicksilver, but they, that can only go so far. They, I don't think they're going to be able to cover every single character from that point. Either way, I'm hoping that this movie really sticks closer to the comics as possible. As for a box office, if they can pull off this whole character ownership complication out of the way, then I definitely think that we could be seeing this movie go the same route as Deadpool. You know, Wolverine is such a loved character, and Old Man Logan is just the definitive Wolverine story. You know, it's definitely the most raw, most brutal, most savage story in the, in the entire Marvel Universe from, from my perspective. And there's just, there's so much carnage, there's so much bloodshed, and it's just perfect just to see this movie in the theater with that solid R rating. I'm glad this movie's taking its time because even Hugh Jackman said he wants this movie to be perfect. That's all I've got for you guys, just a quick update letting you know that this, that Wolverine 3 will take place in the future and it could possibly, most likely, be an Old Man Logan style comic adaptation film. If you enjoyed the video, then smack that like button, as always appreciated. If you have any comments or questions, them down below, get back to you as soon as possible. Also, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button to see more content like this. See you guys next time.